Ronald McDonald? Oh, boy, it's you don't Ronald McDonald, boy. <laughs> that text is on screen right now you swore they would like the video and now you have to do it guys thanks so much <laughs> love you guys i'm gonna catch you later just want to remind you guys to subscribe to the channel real quick and turn on those post notifications so you're notified of all my uploads yo what's going on guys welcome back to more content on the channel today so we're gonna play true peace now guys i'm in a brand new area right now you understand what i'm saying so my mic quality might sound different than the previous videos and there might be a little bit of an echo but within the next couple of days i should have that sorted uh trust me i went through blood sweat and tears today <laughs> to get this thing set up so you guys better <clears throat> you better drop a like on this video right now cut i better get a million views by tomorrow <laughs> ah man i'm gonna go cry myself to sleep bro because I, I am getting nowhere near that amount of views but it's all right guys you know i'm swole at the end of the day so i, I love myself <laughs> all right so you guys seem to love this game look at this thing this thing has 11,500 people playing right now this game has been popping off so I thought I would go back to this One Piece game and, you know, attempt to get some Devil Fruits. Because last time we became a swordsman, we did the typical Yoru route. This time, uh, let's see what these uh, fruits are all about in this game, guys. So without further ado, let's dive right into this. All right, I forgot to uh, to buy two times money boost and then the two times drop boost. So might as well just buy that, right? And since we're doing, you know, Devil Fruits and stuff, I'll buy Conqueror's Hockey so I can show that off too. Ah, yes, perfect. Um, This is... I'm having flashback withdrawals from the last time I went to a new setup area and my internet was laggy and things were working. So, ah, oh, yes. Amazing. I am, uh, yes. <laughs> you know, slowly but surely, we are spawning in, boys. We're getting there. Ah, yes. <laughs> Fat Vex is in the building, baby. Oh, no. All right. We're going to go ahead and check out Conqueror's Hockey first, right? Because I think in the last video, we left off at the point where we got to a brand new island. But uh, the issue was that we got, you know, we got we got Molly whopped. You know what I mean? We, got, we caught an L. Ooh. It's all right, guys. You know, L's are lessons. So ain't nothing big. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Let me go ahead and take this guy's kill, though. Mm, get wrecked, kid. You're trapped. Oh, wait. This kid's a player. <laughs> all right. Mm, what the hell? I said, mm, mm, die. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and use Conqueror's Hockey. Let's press the H key. Everybody bow down to me. Damn. All right, so when you use Conqueror's Hockey, the players don't bow down to you. The people that bow down to you or get knocked out, if you will, uh, are the NPCs, which is very, very unfortunate. This quest right here gave us a bunch of EXP. This is like one of the daily quests, I think. So we're gonna accept it and we're gonna do it real quick. And then we're gonna, we're gonna see if basically, you know, we still get pretty much a bunch of EXP, if you will. All right, I kind of forgot that it's not the sword bandits that we need to defeat, it's the bandits it's and then the uh the bandit boss right so let's try to do that oh my gosh i'm kind of forgetting how to play the game but it's all right brother i got it ain't no thing man there's nothing i can't do mama said i was special brother oh <laughs> wait a minute wait a minute wait a minute maybe mama lied to me i don't know why she did that but maybe she wanted me to feel good for some reason <laughs> maybe she thought i wasn't happy enough for being swole baby but it's all right because mama ain't never lied look i just killed the bandit boss kid you ain't special like me you're not swole like well i'm, I'm kind of fan of this game but you're, you're still not swole like me kid i'm not gonna lie this quest would have been a lot easier to do if there weren't like 50 million people just attacking bandits i mean granted there's only one kid here but it feels like a million people all right here's the last one mm, baby did i gain levels i don't know i'm level 100 i don't know what level i was at the beginning of this video but <laughs> probably i didn't gain any levels all right anyway enough of that we're gonna go into the shop here uh we are going to buy random demon fruit for 1000 bow bucks baby so let's hope that we get one of the legendary ones so i'm just gonna check out the trello real quick just to make sure yo my internet bro down here is bad but yeah anyway just gonna check where the uh the devil fruits are at man all right they call them demon fruits in this game so basically it seems that the only legendary that they have is the the zone or well the the phoenix fruit or not they have the light fruit the ice fruit magma dark there these are all legendaries so, whoa they have a lot of legendaries actually what the heck all right let's try our luck with so many legendaries that we gotta just what is that the spin fruit i mean the spin fruit the the string fruit oh it's the smoke devil fruit so smoke is a rare which is highly unfortunate i mean i guess i'll i guess i'll eat it whatever 
Let's go ahead. Are you sure you want to eat this item? Yes. All right. So I ate it. So what am I supposed to do now? Like, am I supposed to unequip my sword and then go to skill? Or maybe I can still have my sword skills and also demon fruit at the same time. But uh, we have, yeah, maybe that's the case. Oh, that is OP if that's the case. So let me see. I have my sword out, right? And then I press the three key. Yep. The three key. That was a smoke fist. Whoa. All right. I'm, I'm liking this a lot because most One Piece games don't let you do this, you know? Uh, so my second skill here to unlock is the smoke grab. You need 100 devil fruit mastery. So if I go into stats, I have, where's my devil fruit mastery? I guess power is it but i have a hundred in power already so i don't understand but uh screw it i guess we'll bada be bada boo baby put those 23 in there now if we go back here we still don't have it it says 100 df master is that different than the skill tag oh right it is if you guys take a look at the bottom left hand uh row right hand corner we have mastery level seven so how do we farm mastery do we just use the ability so i used it right there i'm still mastery seven all right so maybe we just gotta kill certain npcs and now i wonder if the mastery is for your devil fruit or for devil fruits in general so let's say i killed this bandit all right i didn't kill the bandit i'm gonna have to attack it three times for us to kill it for real for real all right here we go hit it again and bada beep bada boop or not what how did i miss that i said and bada beep bada boop kid all right dude i don't know how the hell i'm missing these attacks i'm gonna help this kid out though maybe i could just oh he got my kill no i don't take it don't. <sighs> all right i don't know if they just took my kill yeah mastery level seven all right hold on okay okay so i can two hit with your rule or three hit there and then use my three key God, I keep missing the hell out of this skill, dude. It's annoying. All right, come here, kid. How do I? All right, I don't, I don't understand what's going on right now, dude. Point blank. All right, there you go. Point blank at work. Mastery level nine. Yo, get out of here, boy. What do you mean? All right, I'm gonna go to the second island. Uh, we're obviously gonna spin for another fruit, but I just want to see if even at the island that you know I have to be at, if the mastery gain is gonna be that slow. And if it is that slow, then forget about it. I, I don't think mastery should be tied to your devil fruit. I think it should be just a, a whole holistic type of approach if you will because dog what <laughs> that is crazy B basically got no xps for that boy all right so let's go ahead and use our uh premium boat which is the coffin boat here oh i forgot you don't even need to talk to these guys in this game you just click spawn boat and it's literally that simple brother it's that nice and slow brother all right guys so i made it back to the island we're supposed to be at it's actually very dark here right now but i think yeah, this might be the spawn setter person. So I'm just going to set my spawn over here because we really have no reason to go back to Starter Island. So, yep, there you go. So let's go ahead and take a quest from the, the red question mark NPC. I make this game easy. All right, cool. Package one, package two. So it's another delivery quest. I kind of like the delivery quest because they're so freaking easy. I mean, that's really what this guy is uh, is telling us. These delivery quests make the game so freaking easy, brother. So for some reason, I'm clicking deliver, but it's not doing anything. So I don't know. Let's try to deliver to this other person up here, I guess. I don't know. I don't know. Whatever. All right. So look, Sanji's over here. So I guess uh, we might be able to unlock another black leg mastery because in the last video, you know, I was kind of confused as to how the whole skill system worked relative to like race or races if you will so oh we completed the quest so i guess since we had to del deliver you know the package to two locations it didn't properly you know tell you that but uh defeat no okay let's let's not do that because i'm more so interested in unlocking black leg abilities so basically what i was mentioning is if i go back into skills we have race skills um and we actually had the corridor ability and i didn't know that oh no no it's locked off but yeah um the ability that we unlocked was the the gepe whatever this is called so let's see now what my boy sanji is going to give us so black leg trainers we're going to accept this quest these are the guys that we got to kill down over here it should be pretty easy because we kind of over leveled ourselves in the first island so yeah this is definitely way easier than what it should be as you guys can see come here kid come here come here kid yeah you both gonna die today i'm about to show you who has the real black leg <laughs> and i'm not talking about my two legs <laughs> Oh man. All right. Um, we're going to use our three key ability here because I forgot that we're supposed to be grinding our devil fruit mastery. And uh, I'm very clearly not doing that. And let me pop up my quest just so that this is on screen. So uh, we have three more to kill off. Oh my God. I was going to try to kill that guy off with my devil fruit, but it didn't work out. Okay. If I hit this guy one more time, will he die? Okay. No, he didn't. All right. Mm. Yo, I have a little gear. I forgot. Look, mm, baby. Yes, sir. 
I could get hit all day if I wanted to. Now die, kid. All right, so let's see how much our uh, mastery went up by. So let's go into demon fruit skills. Okay, mastery level 15 now. So mastery XP, I guess, depends on the NPC or the level of the NPC that you happen to, to kill off, right? Which uh, is not bad. All right, there we go. And bada be bada boop. There we go. So quest complete. Let's go ahead and go back. We have mastery level 16 now, which is not too shabby. And then our race kills. Yep, we definitely got the corollary ability. So let's put that on our... Uh, our four key so let's try that out there you go that's pretty much the ability it didn't really look great but i mean it gets the job done it's not the best animation we've seen for this attack in a one piece game but again it's snappy and it gets the job done so hey man it is what it is now we're gonna go ahead and take on the tempest kick quest because these users are level 52 so that should be easy levels as well all right so we just took the quest i'm gonna defeat five of these guys or well eight of these guys and i'll be right back now i will point out that since the last time i played the game I, I just wanted to say this, this is pretty cool um they added a left control toggle for running so no longer do you have to hold down uh left control or shift or whatever to run you can literally well it's left control not shift because shift uh shift locks but yeah you don't have to hold it down to run you can just press it and run which is amazing i i really like that so i'm glad that they did this quality of life update you know you know just to take it a step further from this though it would be nice if they added a permanent toggle so if i were to press you know control i'm running forever so even if i stop i'll continue running no matter what up until i press control again if that makes sense I feel like that would be uh, a pretty good addition. You guys let me know what you think about that, you know? All right, guys, we completed the quest and we got to level 103. These quests, I don't know, it's like not that easy to level up compared to the previous video. So I don't know if they also readjusted the XP gains and how easy it is to level, but it definitely is seemingly more difficult to level up in this video than in the last one. Now, if we take a look at the map, um, Sacred Dawn Island is levels 50 through 100, and then the Orange Town is level 100 to 150. So probably that's also another reason why I'm not gaining good XP is because these quests are intended for way, way lower level, you know, player than what I am. <laughs> I'm basically too slow, kid. Yeah. I try to tell you mama said I was special. <laughs> Oh boy. All right, let's go ahead and take this daily quest here. The brute boss, blah, blah. All right, let's see where the brute boss is at, though. I don't really. Oh, there seems to be another race quest over here as well. Okay, so we have a couple of uh, weak brutes that are here. So we'll defeat these guys. Oh, this is the brute boss, man. This man is weak, brother. You guys see that combo wombo? Yeah, black leg mastery, baby. And the smoker fruit. Dream come true. And I don't have to be scared of any of these guys anymore, man, because they just don't do anything thanks to the Logia effect, you know? But yeah, look at this daily combo right here. Look, 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 look. look. Look, look. Oh my god, you guys see that combo wombo, baby? My two key into my four key into my three key. I'm gonna show you guys that again if you case you if you missed it. Coil it, coiling kick, and then smoke punch. And then yeah, he didn't die somehow. <laughs> but but I don't know. I, I like that combo. It's pretty nice. Alright, I'm about to clap this man up, and there you go, guys. Completed the quest. I didn't what the hell? I didn't really get any XP for that. Yeah, I'm still over 103, but whatever. All right, who's this? Skypean, test your power. Can you defeat? Sure. Where, where are they? What are these guys? Level 50? Yeah, I'm going to get out of here, though, because I'm getting all these, like, quests, which are nice if we ever get a Skypean race, but I'm going to keep it a stack with you, man. Like, I don't know. I don't know if we'll ever get that lucky in this game. <laughs> Maybe I'll get that lucky when I, uh, <clears throat> oh, I don't know, maybe hit up my boy Desi to hit up the owner to <laughs> maybe slide some things my way. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. We'll see, man. Oh, I think I have the chance to hit all three of these guys here. Look at that. Oh, no. I only hit both of them. Or two, should I say. Bro, I think I think Blackleg is busted in this game. So we completed the quest and we got to level 105. But watch this. I think I can press the four key from here. Oh, all right. I'm stupid. But I mean, it has decent tracking or honing because if I can use it from here. I... <sighs> Yeah, I, I'll stop. All right, boys. So I'm leaving this island because I'm not really gaining levels from being at this island anyways. So I'm going to just, you know, be on my way. going to make my way to... I can't commentate. I'm going to make my way to Orange Town. <laughs> and uh, we'll see what happens there on out. I think Orange Town is this way anyways. Northeast. Because if I look at my handy dandy map, you guys can see Orange Town is right eastward of Sacred Dawn Island. Crazy thing is, I don't really... I don't see it down over here, but you know, I guess eventually we'll make it. Maybe, 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 uh, oh no, there it is. It just spawned in right now. By the way, just to keep you guys posted, we are level 33 mastery for our de uh, demon fruit or devil fruit, whatever you want to call it. I, I don't know. I don't know what to say. We're going to get to 100 to unlock the smoke wrap, but after that, we're definitely going to spin uh, for a legendary fruit. Like, we're going to try. 
All right, so we made it to Orange Town. It's going to set my spawn point. And I already saw the daily quest for this area. So we're going to try to do that first. Well, I don't know if these quests are daily. Maybe they they have like a reset timer of a couple of hours. I don't know. But the blue quest, I know that you can only... Oh, they have a golden quest now. Damn. All right, we're going to check that out. But before we do that, let's just uh, talk to Doodle Bear. He says, uh, get rid of these waistband clowns. Oh, damn. All right, I can't do that, brother. I'm sorry. I apologize. I'll, I'll be on my way. <laughs> Man said you need to be level 120, bro. What the hell? All right, golden quest. What is this? Civilian. Clowns are taking over the island. Can you defeat? Yes. Uh, who? Okay, so these guys, I guess. Yo, these guys are cake to kill, boy. What do they need my help for? Yeah, what do they need? Bro, I'm almost one-shotting these guys, and I just got here. Is this Ronald McDonald? Oh, that is Ronald McDonald, boy. <laughs> Yo, they added a Ronald McDonald would have made him a strong clown in this game. That is crazy to me, dude. <laughs> oh, that is so funny, boy. That is crazy. Ooh, these guys give 4,000 XP a pop. Yo, that might that might have given us a... Yeah, we went from 33 to mastery level 42. Dude, these guys give 4,000 XP a pop. That's crazy. Bro, I, I'm like gaining decent amount of XP to the point where I don't even have to complete the quest to... Oh, damn, I missed that. But yeah, I don't even have to complete the quest to really just get good XP. I can just simply attack these guys and I'll be straight. Anyway, um, who is the next NPC that we need to kill? We need to kill Clown Pirates. Where are those guys at? I don't know. We'll, we'll go ahead and check this way. Maybe they are this way. Clown Pirates. It's weird because they have the quest indicator set to down there, but... Well, let me just double check. Yeah, I'm dumb. Yeah, these guys right next to them are the clown pirates. All right, no problem. I caught that. I got that. I got that. No worries. No worries, man. Now, for some reason, the clown pirates are very difficult to kill, and they also give 4,000 XP. So, not understanding here why the sharp difference. Maybe this is a bug or a glitch. I don't know. But you best believe I'm going to go ahead and just, uh, you know, gain some levels, cut. And not off of these guys. I'm just going to keep doing, or well, keep killing the other, uh, the clown cannon, the cannoneers. All right, guys, we're about to complete the quest from level 106, and we're level 112. But yeah, man, I mean, these guys are insanely, like, bro, I can just kill them in one combo string basically and uh i mean as you guys can see we get really good xp like this is really 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 good xp for how quick it is to kill these guys off i think the reason why we get so much xp is because these guys when they have a distance or some distance between you they're really really hard to to kill because they do a lot of damage all right so i got one more level uh, that's all i'm gonna get from these guys i think i can keep doing this uh, my commentary god damn what the hell's wrong with me but yeah i can keep doing this quest if i want to you know what maybe hmm ah, nah, not really i was gonna say maybe i could keep doing this quest until i get to 120 but ah well yeah screw it whatever who cares we'll do it I'll do it one more time. See if we can get to 120. That way we can take on the, you know, the daily quest right away. All right, guys, I completed the quest. And in actuality, we just got to 120. So, well, not really just got to 120. We're about to be 121. But, you know, we got the level that we wanted. So let's go ahead and do his quest. So we got to kill. All right, we got to kill six clown pirates. And then we got to kill some of the Ronald McDonald's. So we're going to see how this goes. I found a really good combo string. And it's basically to use the coiler click into the smoke punch. That seems to work even better than us doing the other combo, which was, you know, uh, basically this barrage or this ability here from the, um, the Yuru kill, uh, skill set, excuse me. So yeah, just, uh, when I get it off, that coiler kick is, is really good because, you know, it stuns them and then you can follow it up with a free hit with the smoker punch. Just as such right here, guys. You see that? Really good combo. Okay. So I think we just got a drop. Yeah. We got a drop from one of these guys here. I don't know what this is, but I'll check it out in a bit. All right. So we're going to check our inventory. We basically got a steel katana with a hundred strength, which which is basically worse than the steel club that we got from the bandit boss whatever boss that we did in the last video this is trash but it's all right we're gonna go ahead and talk ronald mcdonald now oh well maybe we should take on the pirate boss yeah let's do that before damn can i not hit homie with a oh logia all right this is gonna be annoying oh what mm, all right brother all right brother you're asking for it brother oh no buggy yeah because but you know swords don't work on buggy that's why all right i'm dead well not gonna cap i uh I'm probably gonna struggle with this. Maybe I can keep like just going back to him, cheesing out the skills that do work, and then abusing my Conqueror's hockey with my H key. Cause that does a significant amount of damage. I don't know if you guys peeped that when I was using it earlier in the video. Watch. Come here, buggy. Get on your knees, kid. There you go. You guys see it does like a decent amount of damage. It's not crazy, but it works better than nothing, right? Oh my god, buggy, get off, kid. Damn. All right, can I use my Corla kick? Yeah, all right. What about, what about, what about this? Does this work? Okay, yeah. Okay, so that move does work. I can't use the smoker punch on him for some reason, but whatever. I'm dead. I think my cooldown timer on Conqueror's Hockey should reset. Mm-hmm. It did. <laughs> Stupid game. You're going to get wrecked. Oh, no. I'm getting wrecked right now. Oh, no. <laughs> All right, hold on, hold on. Maybe if I reset, it'll work. Ah, damn it. Stupid game. <laughs> mm, 
frustrating. All right, I'm gonna have to rejoin. All right, well, at least my quest progress saved by uh, making my way back into the game. Now, hopefully it's the same server, because if that's the case, then homies should still be at the same HP. Now, I wanted to show you guys where I'm at with my demon fruit mastery. Oh, I'm level 99. Oh, so it works. So yeah, killing these guys off works. All right, hold on. I think I'm in the same server too. Oh yeah, man, they want to see me win for real today, baby. They definitely want to see me win tonight, boys. All right, buggy, just bring it on, buggy. I don't, I don't even care, cuz to be honest, you're like that weak, cuz I just, I don't care. You know, I really, I really don't, buggy. Kill me, buggy. Go ahead, kill me, cuz. Kill me, what you waiting for, bro? What you waiting for? You waiting for yourself to die, cuz? Are you waiting for you? Are you waiting for you? Oh, I killed him. <laughs> if you look at the quest. <laughs> In the left, I killed, dude. I thought I glitched him out and I was gonna be so mad, but no, we're good, we're good, we're good. All right, Ronald McDonald is no joke. Man just took a full combo string and he's still at half HP. Yeah, Ronald McDonald is tough, boy. Ronald ain't no joke around these streets, man. <laughs> he might be a clown, that man ain't no joke, boy. Ah, oh, God damn it, Ronald. Wait, Ronald, I can explain. If you just give me a moment of your time, Ronald, I can explain. You know, McDonald's about to cut you out. All right, there you go, stupid. <laughs> Ronald's like, wait, what? They were gonna cut me off. Oh gosh, darn it! Yuck! <laughs> <laughs> My man became a goofy real quick, right, guys? Um, hello. All right, there you go. He's working now. Come here, catch this out, kid. The hell wasn't that the last one? All right, I gotta kill one more. So remember, guys, I'm level 122, and then uh, we'll test out my other mastery, and then uh, we'll we'll see if we can get a new devil fruit. But come on, Ronald. Turn around and die. Turn around and die, Ronald. Yeah, brother. Level 138, mm, brother. Yay. Now, if we check our skills, we are also at 110 mastery for our demon uh, devil fruit, whatever you want to call it. My five key is uh basically move over to use the skill what the hell did i just oh damn i brought that man to me bro oh that's tough oh that's real tough to be honest with you oh wait 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 wait! don't kill me don't kill me though but yeah look guys like this is a really good strat look i'm mastery 118 so uh 200 mastery for the next ability you know really good strat is to basically kill these guys off I, I ended up dying, but you know, what I was saying is that was at 114 mastery. If we go back in here, we are now at 120. So six levels. That's a really good amount of levels, bro. And they're super easy to kill. Now, granted, is it going to be that easy with every devil fruit? Probably not. And uh, I will go ahead and show you that right now. So let's go ahead and remove our devil fruit. Can't believe we got to waste money even for this. There you go. We died. But now, brother, we're going to buy another random devil fruit. Come here. Mm, sounds delicious. Sounds like a legendary. I got the same crap again, boy. I'm done, bro. I, you know what, y'all? Because I'm not no cheap steak, right? And because I love you guys. And because I, cause I know you guys about to give me 10,000 likes and whatnot and a million views. I'll do it one more time, baby. Because mama ain't raised open. Legendary. What the hell is this? What fruit is it? The chop. So as you guys can see, the chop um, demon fruit is a rare. I guess I'll eat it because content why not i guess um yeah why is this guy trying to hit me dude if i step out here bro i will literally wreck you dude you're garbage kid like what the hell is he trying to accomplish come here come here what are you trying to what are you trying to accomplish bro like you're, you're so bad bro like come here come on out bro come on out bro come on bro come on out dookie <laughs> i don't even know how i got a 10k bounty from him because that man was trash <laughs> Oh, man, if you're a subscriber, dude, I'm sorry. I don't know. Maybe you're trying to give me a free kill. Oh, he's back. Do you want to fight for real now or are you going to run away? What the hell? All right, yo, that, that guy has problems. <laughs> yo, what the hell is this game, dude? Anyway, we're going to go into demon fruit skills. We have the... What the... F okay, my three key ability. Bro, what? All right, dog, I guess. Let's see how much damage it does, though, because it looks dumb, but maybe it does a lot of damage. So we use a four key, three key. Yeah, the smoke fruit is way better than this fruit, bro. Oh, my God. And the mastery is for every different. Oh, my God. Look, my mastery level is five. Man, you know what? Yeah, I'm out of here, man. Uh, Fruits, not my thing in this game. I think I'm going to stick to being a sword user. I don't know, bro. <laughs> what the? Ah, frustrated.